Hey, what's up everyone? Uh, today is May 16th and the reason I'm making this video is because yesterday was May 15th and May 15th here in Korea is Teacher's Day and teachers are well-respected members of the community so um, if you're a teacher you, you have um, a pretty high standing amongst like the way people look at you and treat you and respect you in Korean society. It, it's um, a very sought-after job to become a teacher and um, yeah, so just everybody loves teachers and so they have Teacher's Day where students can show appreciation to their former teachers. Now, um, that's not just for like elementary students or middle school students or even high school students visiting like their teacher from last year or something like that. Um, there's adults, there's people in their 30s, 40s, 50s that are going to their hometowns or to the universities and visiting their old professors, their old um, school teachers if they're still around and, or even if they're not around they'll go and visit them at their house you know um, so it's kind of a really big deal here in Korea um, last year I was uh, last year was my first year teaching here and so um, the students from the year before you know I, I didn't have anybody um, to come and visit me but this year since this is my second year my former students um, from sixth grade last year who are now in middle school seventh grade they came and visited me, which is really awesome. So I got to see a lot of them. I got to um, take their pictures, hang out with them, record some video. And uh, it was really funny because uh, they were just really happy to see me. I was really happy to see them. And it's very interesting to see how fast um, they grow. You know, they're in their adolescent ages now. And uh, yeah, so they're just having growth spurts. and. Um, they're all tall now, it's really crazy. Um, in, in just a couple months, they've all grown so tall. But, uh, so this year, I wanted to share with you some things that I received. Now, I didn't receive any cookies or anything like that. Last year, I got some cookies um, just from my current, uh, well, at the time, current students. And uh, this year, the only kind of consumable thing I got was this, which is a bottle of vitamin C um, drink here. This is really, um, sweets but loaded with vitamin C uh, really good to drink if you're sick um, you know so uh, this is the only consumable thing that I got uh, but I did get two letters um, two handwritten letters from some students and then I got some other things I'm going to show you in a minute here but um, I'm going to go ahead and read you what um, one of the letters my one of my students wrote here um, this is from uh, one of my boys in the fifth grade uh, Pak Ju, uh, Wanju so he says, uh, Corey teacher, hello Corey teacher, my name is Pak Wanju, 5 3, so uh, grade 5, uh, third homeroom. Uh, class, 5 3 class, teacher and became a period of months. Okay. I've heard you've grown. I don't know why he's saying that to me. I've heard you've grown. Uh, thank you for teaching me English. Thank you for cheering football match yesterday. They had a soccer match yesterday and I was cheering for them. And he was, uh, he was on the team. Um, it's difficult to write in English, Corey teacher, I love you. Yeah, so um, it says good, and it's got like a picture of a thumbs up and a heart. Um, so that's kind of funny. And then uh, another one that I got from one of my fourth grade um, students, she, uh, her name is Suwa, but she has an English name from her Hagwan, her private academy, um, which they gave her Leia, 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 yeah, Leia. So, her letter says, Hello, Corey teacher. I'm Suwa. Leia is my English name. I'm very thanks to you. You are the best English teacher. I like your games. I want to learn with you all day. Your face is so handsome. I like your acting, too. I'm sorry it is so short, but my love is long. Bye. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Funny. I, I think she's talking about the letter being short. But, uh, yeah, she wrote it on this cool paper. And then she's got, like, this stuff. So, um... Yeah, it's funny because boys and girls, they'll, they'll just say I love you on everything and um, it's just their way of saying that they love the teacher and stuff, you know, and not like they love me, they're infatuated with me or something. But yeah, she gave it in this like cool envelope thing. It says, to Corey teacher. So, uh, the other thing I wanted to show you was over here. Okay, so this is my desk, but uh, one of my former sixth grade students gave me a pink rose. Yeah, so I, I don't have a vase or anything for it, a vase. So I'm just like got in there with this cup of water. Um, and then I had one of my classes, they took my school photo 
from the yearbook and then they like Xeroxed it and then traced it and then they wrote all these messages and stuff, which is really really cool um, Corey teacher. I love English class. Thank you. Thank you for teaching me. I love teacher uh, Yeah, I'm trying to look for some funny ones Corey teacher. Thank you. I'll be a good student uh, I love teacher. Thank you for teaching me. I'm happy when you teaching me <laughs> still learning but yeah, it's you can tell like they they're really really thankful. Look, I love you. I love you, Corey teacher. Thank you. I love you, teacher. So, um, really really cool to get these kind of messages from my students and um, knowing that they actually like me and whatnot. And there's someone even drew a little picture of me with my big nose. And says thank you. And then there's a little yeah a little stick figure body. Um, then I got this uh, cool poster here made by um, fifth grade um, fifth grade um, number one class. And uh, this is pretty funny. They got a little drawing there of me. As I say, Cory teacher, teacher, thank you. English is very fun. E funny. Okay. Uh, let's see. Cory teacher, Cory teacher, I love you. Is very Cory te what? Cory teacher is very good. Teacher, I love you. Okay. There's a lot of I love yous all over this thing. Um, let's see. Cory teacher, I'm enjoy English class. Uh, I know there's a funny one on this one. Cory teacher, you're very kind. Thank you. Oh, that's nice. Um, ah, Cory teacher, I always love Cory teacher and English time. It's very funny. Your teach is very excited. Okay, spelled wrong, but um, I want Cory teacher. I love you. Okay, that's kind of strange. But um, what's this? Uh, Cory teacher, I love English class. English class is funny. Thank you. Yeah, so it's really really cool. And then they, you know, wrote my name and have a little smiley face and stuff. Yeah, Cory something name. Cory teacher. So really, really cool. Um, it's a it's a fun thing to be a teacher here in Korea. Um, you get all kinds of stuff. So um, and you get to see all your former students come and visit you. And uh, yeah, my former sixth grade students. They're just it was it was super awesome. So you could, you could see that footage earlier. Well, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Teachers' Day, May fifteenth, here in Korea. It's a really, really big deal, and um, I'm very happy that this is my second time. I'm experiencing it. I'm hoping to experience it many more times and hopefully my um, former sixth grade students from last year will come visit me every year um, wherever and then I can see them and see how tall they've grown and become, um, turning into young adults and stuff. So really, really cool. Um, I'm very excited. So yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. Bye.